All right, Libra, I am so sorry I tried to do this, but I am losing space on my phone. I have way too much, too many pictures and videos. Anyway, Libra, your ancestors want you guys to go look at the stars. You block someone and you're ending a conflict with that person. Your ancestors are blocking that person out. This is your time to say goodbye to people, places, and things. People, places, and things that you caught them and they are blocked now. You are done. If you know something is wrong for you, spirit said stop. Okay, it's warning you of health issues. This is overthinking. This is a person that's putting you in a mental conflict with yourself. Some of you guys are dealing with someone who blocked out your 11th house. Groups, friends, social awareness, technology, hopes and dreams for the future. This could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio or a Gemini Libra, an Aquarius like yourself. They're mad that you're taking back your power. Now, some of you, um, someone was trying to block your relationships, contracts, business partners, and sharing. Okay, so your ancestors are blocking whoever you cut out that's a Cancer Pisces Scorpio or a Gemini Libra and Aquarius. Okay, so definitely keep that person blocked. Yes, toxic people, your ancestors know these people have bad addictions, they're giving you bad advice, and they're hanging out with the wrong crowd. Spell work wanted to come out. You guys are being protected from spell work at this time. Wants you to struggle so they can pick you up. Someone wants you to struggle so bad so that you can run back to them and deal with that same negative cycle all over again. Okay, so some of you guys are being blocked from traveling at this time. Okay, so it's a blessing in disguise. If you can't make it to that person, place, or thing, it's a blessing in disguise. Someone is playing mind games with you as well. They're immature. They're testing you. They're analyzing you. You are being blocked from that person. What is meant for you will always be for you. Rejection is God's protection. So just know that, Libra. Okay, so your ancestors want you to, to know that at this time. Rejection is God's protection. And you are being blocked from a person that got caught. And now you block them out of your energy, but they are wanting to come back. Now they want a family with you. Wasted time. Yes, this person wants to come back and they want a family with you. They wasted time. Or you guys have a family with this person. She's pissed off, wanted to come out here. I'll take it. Uh, someone wanted a family with you, but they wasted time. They wasted your time. They did something shady and they got caught. Okay, so your ancestors are making sure this person uh, is blocked out of your energy. Yes, sick and tired cycles over it. Decision is made. Your ancestors, this wanted to come out. Someone is envious, a hateful, a jealous person, and they are being blocked. Yes, this man can be trusted. Okay, so some of you guys had a man you thought you could trust. And no, this man cannot be trusted. Okay, you guys thought this about this man. But this man, Libras, put you all up in your head. Put you in mental chaos. Okay, so I did say water sign, and here it is, Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Uh, trashy co-worker, drugs, can't figure you out. So there's a person that is a trashy co-worker, they're on drugs, they're always drinking, and they can't figure you out. You are being blocked from this person as well, okay? They're trying to do something regarding your finances. You're being blocked from a trashy co-worker that's into these things. Someone is or will, something is or will be told to you which you should not believe. So somebody, Libras, wants you in gossip. Your ancestors are blocking that out before it even happens. Some of you guys are dealing with twin flames. You're being blocked from a twin flame. Okay, so this twin flame is unawakened and ruled by their ego at this time. They have addiction problems. If you're wondering why you feel so attached to this person, yes, they are your twin flame, but they have addiction problems and your ancestors are blocking this person out. Says you are a bad parent. So somebody is going around saying that you are a bad parent and they are being blocked from your energy or your ancestors are blocking this person out from telling all these lies or um yeah so we have gossip out here somebody wants to say that you're a bad parent this is your dim divine masculine but he's not ready he has addictions yes libra you are dealing with a divine masculine he is your twin flame but he is unhealed and ruled by his ego at this time he has addiction problems okay so you are being blocked at this time from your twin and that's okay because you don't want someone in your energy anyway. This divine masculine could be a hidden drug addict, okay? They like to pop pills. They're a drug addict. They're doing things that 
will cause you harm anyway. So this person, you're being blocked by a person that just wants to come in and have, they have intense feelings about you. They have sexual um, thoughts and fantasies about you as well. Give me one second, guys. I need to pick up these cards on the floor. Yeah, so someone is having sexual thoughts about you. They are self-pleasuring themselves to you and they have intense feelings. Okay, so your ancestors are blocking this person out from coming in because that's all you are to them is just a piece of meat. Hating on your beauty, doing spell work to make you feel ugly or have you feel this way. So someone is being blocked from hating on your beauty, sending you guys dark spells and... Uh, making you feel ugly. So for those, some we do have spell work out here. So sometimes it does get through. Spiritual attacks do get through. But your ancestors are trying to block it out and give you the guidance that you need to pick yourself up through this. Okay, so you guys need to stay strong at this time. Signs you could be dealing with is a Virgo. We have Pisces energy out here. Libra energy. Cancer energy. Pisces again, Sagittarius energy, Virgo energy, Pisces energy, heavy Pisces energy, Leo energy, Gemini energy, water and air signs are out here, uh, Virgo energy, Aquarius energy, Gemini energy, Gemini again. Gemini, again, definitely dealing with a Gemini, Virgo, and a Pisces, Capricorn energy, Capricorn again, and Aries energy. Okay, I'm going to leave. Those are the signs. If you did not resonate with any of those signs that I called out, and some of this does resonate with you, okay? Some of you guys could be feeling uh, what's being blocked out is some of you guys have been feeling this way, and your ancestors are stepping in saying, no more for my Libras, I'm blocking this out for you guys. Okay, so ancestors of Libra, what is it that you would like them to focus on and know at this time? What can they do to move forward in healthy ways? Okay, so ancestors, Libra's ancestors. Okay, so some of you guys are living in fear. Okay, some of you guys uh, want to take a person back that is, this could be your divine masculine, but he is unhealed. Okay, this man cannot be trusted. Yes, I twin flame you're fearful with your twin flame at this time this man is unhealed he's ruled by his ego he could have addiction problems and he could be very toxic you're being blocked by this man because from coming in because uh yes distance yourself from this man your ancestors are making sure he's not taking action or you're not taking action at this time because issues um, drug addict issues or secret addictions or just anything. Okay. So you're being blocked from him. Yeah. Some of you guys want to be nurtured by this person and somebody can be guarded. Okay. They're, they're not guarded or they're guarded at this time because this person is all about the ego. Okay. They don't want to come in and nurture you. They don't want to give you compassion. You guys need to focus on self-love. Okay. Creating something new. Your intentions will be to create and stop the cycles with this person. Focus on self-love and you guys will have a rebirth in the winter time. Okay. I, I'm getting that for a lot of signs. Yes. You guys need to um, have self-care. Work on self-care, self-love, and regain your energy back. Your ancestors are tired of these people coming in your life and taking your energy. You could be a giving person, and these people just keep coming in, taking everything left that you have, okay? So your ancestors are making sure that you guys regain your energy back. We have chemistry and pass passion. Yes, you do have chemistry and passion with this person. This person is your divine masculine, but this person tells uh, half truths, okay? So half truth, truth is a lie, okay? This person's not going to come in and tell you and nurture you the way you want. See, this person has makeup on their face. They're not going, it's like a mask, okay? They're not going to come in and give you everything you want at this time. Yes, trust in divine timing, okay? So you guys need to trust in divine timing. This is not, don't rush this. If you rush this, you're going to get this, okay? An unexpected storm, a tower moment. This is your house. This is your foundation. Spirit is going to come in and shake shit up for you guys, all right? You don't want that. They, they're warning you. If you take this person back right now, 
uh, they're going to come in and cause this. You guys need to be open to change and have the courage to change and be open to receive as well. You guys need to open yourselves up to uh, heal yourselves and be open to new things at this time. Your ancestors are trying to give you um, messages through your dreams, okay? So some of you guys definitely wake up, pay attention to those dreams, write them down. Look them up if you need to. Be present. They want you to be present and abundant and have the gratitude for you living in the present as well. Some of you guys will be planting new seeds in the springtime. Okay, so springtime. Wintertime, you guys will have a awakening and a rebirth, okay? But in the springtime, you guys will be planting new seeds and you will have a wish fulfillment as well. So wish fulfillment is coming. Make sure you do the healing. Pay attention to what your ancestors are trying to uh, tell you guys regarding your dreams. All right. Jess, air sign, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius energy. We did have that for you guys. Something happened in the fall, or this is the fall, and you guys need to make sure you take a leap into something new. Free yourself from this person. Okay, jump into new opportunities. You guys need to do the... Uh, external work okay some of you guys are partying you need to sit back stay away from drinking and partying with friends and do the external work some of you guys could be doing that at this time because you guys are too busy thinking of past memories and this is helping you take your mind off it all right so you're having a nostalgia for someone from your past you guys need to stop partying and do the healing work your ancestors want you to focus on that Okay, so if you have to silence yourself, stay away from toxic people, places, and situations, you need to do so. You are being guided to do so. If you take this person back, this is only going to happen. Interrogation in a union. Okay, you guys need to focus on your career at this time. All right, so some of you guys could be married to these people until debt do us part and you have contracts with them, but you want to go back to them. You can't go back to them. You need to release and surrender and purge this person out of your life for now and focus on your career, making money opportunities. Yes, this person's living in their ego. Okay, they have they're all about vanity and pride. Or this is you, you guys need to jump out of your egos and stay away from this energy cancer pisces scorpio you guys are dealing with cancer pisces scorpio i did say uh that in the very beginning along with air sign gemini libra and aquarius which both did come out you guys are suffering from rejection and loss that's okay like i said rejection is god's protection you need to step into your higher self and activate your higher self that's what they want you to do okay so rejection is god's protection libras and you will be fine yes you guys are stuck in your comfort zone you're clinging to the past okay you need to stay away from the past and have your breakthrough when you do that you will have a breakthrough but you are avoiding healing your inner child and your ancestors want you to stop avoiding that they want you to step in and heal your inner child so when i get this card if you look at the picture that is her when she was younger, okay, healing the inner child. Would you tell yourself, would you, if you were face-to-face -face with your, your child or your, um, your past, this is you. If you were face-to-face -face with the old, old you, the younger version of you, would you let this younger version go through all this? No, you would not, okay? So you guys need to make sure you heal yourself. Focus on self-love which this is catching my eye, it's right next to it, self-love, creation, okay, no more of this, someone is taking control, they want to control your life, there's control tactics they're using, okay, you guys need to have growth in your life, you will have growth in the summertime as well, yes, some of you are living in the past, you're lacking and you're suffering because you have, you're too focused on past situations with a person, place, or thing, Spirit wants you to cut that out. You you feel guilty or they feel guilty or there's some type of sabotage happening. Okay, so your ancestor guides, okay, there they are right there. They're stepping in. They want you guys to do self-love, self-healing, 
okay? So no more reflection and projections onto people, okay? Because you're lacking and you have doubts in your life, they don't want you. And there's a separation in your life. They don't want you to long for this person, okay? There needs to be a lot of healing before this connection comes back into your life. Yes, there's a lot of uh, confusion and illusions at this time. Someone is wearing rose-colored glasses. They could be telling you, uh, everything you want to hear, they could be coming in with an apology and forgiveness, but this person doesn't mean it, okay? They're living out of their ego. Your spirit guides are assisting you. They're trying to get you to make sure you know this, okay? Because you deserve this home and this family and this commitment. Now, it may be with this person or it may not be with this person, but they want you guys to know that you are deserving of that and they want you to heal so that they can give it to you. Once you, yes, transform, exactly what I was just saying. Once you transform, they will send this in for you, okay? There needs to be justice and balance in a situation and one of you does not have that, okay? So Libra, if you resonate with this, then it's you. You need to do the self-healing and... If this person is meant in your life, they will come back. What is meant for you will always be for you, okay? Someone needs to do the shadow side. Focus on their shadow side, the dark night of the soul, okay? Someone is too busy spying, watching on another person and not doing the healing work that they need to. They need to be uh, have the strength to focus on healing, okay? This could be a divine masculine you guys are dealing with. They keep spying, Someone is closed off, detached, they're all up in their head, and they need to find the balance, okay? No more spying. This could be you, or this could be the divine masculine doing this, but someone needs to heal themselves and create a solid foundation before they even come back in. We have fire sign energy, so some of you guys are dealing with a fire sign, Aries Leo Sagittarius person, and this person is needing stability to go with the flow at this time this could be your divine masculine someone is blocked from taking action or when this this fire sign does come back in uh they will have you will be with this fire sign okay you're attracted to this person and they will be a gift in your life you'll be open to receive or spirit is giving you a new person in your life and that is a fire sign once you start to focus on yourself you guys have a divine masculine that is a aries leo sagittarius person coming in for you guys okay so once you heal from this past person you have a new person coming in all right all right libras that has been your reading thank you for watching bye